A murder suspect on the run for more than a year and a half is arrested in Mexico and is now in the Dallas County Jail. Valcina Valdez is accused of killing his girlfriend, his ex girlfriend, Marisol Espinosa, in December of 2015. Brittany Jeffers joins us now live at the Dallas County Courthouse, or excuse me, Dallas County Jail, with more on his arrest and what the victim's family has to say. Brittany. Yeah, Karen, a Mexican newspaper reported that officials arrested him during an immigration stop. We can tell you that when he got here and was transported to Dallas last night and booked, he didn't have anything to say to us and didn't have a comment and kept his head down. However, we did speak with Marisol's family. She tells CBS 11 that this arrest is pivotal in getting justice for Marisol. I want to thank everyone for all their prayers. Marisol Espinosa's family reported her missing in 2015 after she failed to show up for work. Her body was later found three months later under a bridge in southeast Dallas. Now, at the time, her ex and father to two of her children, Faustino Valdez, claimed that he had no idea what happened. But the FBI says that he disappeared after being questioned by police. A Mexican newspaper reports that Valdez was caught during an immigration raid at a Mexican factory where he was working under a fake name. He was deported back to the U.S. where he arrived late yesterday evening. Marisol's relatives tell us they're already preparing themselves for the day that he goes to trial. We will be there. And we will get justice for Marisol. Now, yesterday, CBS 11 reached out to the Valdez family and they said that they did not have any comment as far as his arrest. Reporting live here in Dallas this morning, I'm Brittany Jeffers, CBS 11 News.